Hello friends, welcome to C Programming Tutorials. In this class, we are going to discuss about more standard functions. So, standard character functions. In the keyboard, we have different types of keys. These keys are belongs to two types. One is so control keys, another one is printable keys. So, control keys is nothing but so arrows and enter and coming to printable. So, printable is nothing but except the control keys all the remaining keys are printable keys okay in this printable we have two types one is space another one is graphical key so space key is nothing but white space and graphical means remaining keys in this graphical we have two types one is alphanumeric another one is punctuations so punctuations is nothing but comma double quotation single quotation so these keys we are called as a so punctuation Keys. Remaining keys we are called as a alphanumeric. In this alphanumeric, there are two types alphabetic and digit. All the digits comes into digit keys, and alphanumeric we have two types one is upper, another one is lower. So these are the keys available in the keyboard. So now, so how we are going to know so which key you are going to press? So for that, we have so predefined functions. So classifying functions first one is control if i press arrow button then so this is control button so so this function is becomes true if i press arrow and it is assigned to a variable and we can check that variable for example i press enter that is assigned to a variable a now so is control a if it is arrow then it returns true if i press a number 9 then it returns false Similarly, is printable character. Except the control character, all the characters belongs to printable. If it is a printable, it returns true, otherwise false. Is space. If I press space, it returns true, otherwise false. If the character is graphical, then it returns true, otherwise false. Similarly, is alphanumeric. If I enter any alphabet or digit, then this alphanumeric function returns true otherwise false so is punch so it means if i press a key if the key is punctuations then this function returns true otherwise false is alpha if i press a then this alpha function returns true otherwise false and similarly if i press capital a then is upper function returns true otherwise false is lower if I press small a, then is lower returns true, otherwise false. Is digit, if I press a number, then is digit function returns true, otherwise false. Is x digit, if I give a digit thus, that is in the form of hexadecimal, hexadecimal, then it returns true, otherwise false. If I give a number that is in the form of octal, then is O digit returns true otherwise false. So for example, if I enter capital A, now this printable is true, graphical is true, alphanumeric is true and upper is true. Okay. If I give digit, then printable is true, so graphical is true, alphanumeric is true and digit is true. If I give so punctuation, then printable is true so graphical is true and punctuation is true okay so now we are going to see one small example so this is the program for in your keyboard you are going to press one key the key is stored in one variable so after that you are going to check whether you are going to print a lowercase letter or uppercase letter or digit or punctuation or white space or any other control character okay how so for that you are going to read one character from the keyboard so you are going to write one scanf and we are taking one variable c c equals to so enter a character of that scan of c for example i press white space i press white space so this ascii number is stored in this c now if is lower what it returns it returns false so it goes to else block is upper returns false so it goes to next else is digit false 
so it goes to next else if is punctuation false so it goes to so next else here e space it returns true so we print white space if i enter my c equals to 9 now if is lower false is upper false is digit true so you are going to print digit for example the c equals to arrow button now is lower false is upper false is digit false is punctuation false is space false then we have only else that means it is a control character okay i hope you all are understand these standard character functions so now we are going to see the standard functions character functions so gcc program 17 dot c dot slash a dot out center a character test here if i enter 5 now it displays digit if i enter capital a now it displays uppercase letter if i enter small a now it displays lowercase letter if i press comma then it displays so punctuation character if i press space then it displays white space if i press any control key for example here i am giving the control key this one if i press enter it returns control characters so this is the program